Hi everyone, this is Marvin Morel for Redison and today we're going to talk about how to practice. It is essential to have a regular and thorough practice on a daily basis. Don't have a drum kit? Don't worry, there are plenty of ways to practice, starting by in your head. You can listen to your favorite band's latest album over and over or discover stars you don't know anytime you want thanks to the internet. Also, you can think about what you already play in your band, for example, or about the next groove that you will use to show off in front of your friends. You would like to go further but can't afford a drum kit? Then this is exactly what you need. Sandstroke allows you to play anywhere, at any time, any stars without breaking your piggy bank and without bothering your neighbors. All right, let's put that on and talk a little bit more about how to practice. It is amazing how many people rush into their studies without even wondering how to study. The best advice to that is to go slowly. And when I say slowly, I mean slowly. All right, let's go for an example. See, I took the easiest exercise, going just right, left, right, left. And I played it so slow I could think, and I mean really think, what I was playing. Not only did this help me focus on the time and sound, it also made me work on my body. Indeed, I could check all the articulations working, from my shoulders, to my elbows, to my wrists. Were my arms doing the same movement? Did I hit the center of the snare? Was the sound exactly the same? Did it hurt at some point and why? These are some questions I could ask myself and try to answer while playing. Now, let's try with a different exercise involving feet. Here, I might want to play each part separately as well as keeping a slow tempo. This will help solidify each limb individually and inter-individually before putting it all together. It might sometimes take a little while before mastering a groove, and it takes years to master an instrument, if not an entire life. Remember to be patient and to always stay relaxed. Speed is often confused with tension. Look at the legends playing. Do you feel like Buddy Rich was struggling to throw his role so perfectly? Nope, he could do it without any tension, and this is what you need to aim for. Do you feel like you're stuck? If so, take note of the tempo of the exercises you're working on. If you work well, you will notice that everything gets easier with time and that your tempos will gradually build up. Still stuck? Tell us about your experience in the comment section and we'll try to help you. Or follow the channel for more lessons. This is still Marvin Morel for Redison. Keep on drumming and see you next time.